You bow these jarries is on Kuka more. Being your old news, you know, representing him the image of God platform. <laughs> so, this one, I don't even know if I should laugh or if I should cry for this young man because this young man, you have seen the videos, he's doing a hey, one, two, three, four. Let's rehearse for the queen. You know, we are going to perform for the queen, make the queen happy, and that in the commonwealth, in the commonwealth game. See, for all of you that be chatting about how this country is so great, this is one of the reasons why this country is not great at all. At all, at all, at all. Let's not even forget about Love Island. That's number one reason why the country is not great. But number two is the fact that they do shit like this. And I'm... To be honest with you, I am happy that they're doing this to pass all you. Because you niggas need to understand your place. You niggas need to understand how the law views you and how they don't give a fuck about you. Just because your record label, are, the owner of your record label is a very good friend with the queen does not mean that the, 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 the police department and the justice department give a fuck about you as a black man. Let me just put that one out there like that. Uncle Kamo is care to teach you boys how to carry yourself. So number one, first of all, before we even go to the teaching, to, 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 to the teaching section, Pasali you had to, to he, had, he had a couple things to vent about on Twitter. So I'm going to read what he said. Right? So he said, so this is footage from Mary Hazal. For next week's Commonwealth Games closing ceremony. So it's not even the opening one, it's the closing one. So why are you crying? Anyways, however, yesterday I received a call to say that I am being removed from the show because I failed a background check. There's no background check, but sadly, they just don't want you to succeed. That's okay. I can I can't keep from being silent about this stuff. Exclamation mark, exclamation mark. <laughs> He really wanted us to hear that one. Anyways, I've already had to cancel 90% of my shows this year because the home office won't process the paperwork I need to travel abroad until my court case is finished. I have fully cooperated with the process, attended court on every single day. The trial ended in March, but they still keep moving the final sentencing date which was due to be in May. We are now in August. Just to put it in perspective for all of you. The most recently, the dates moved because the prosecutor, and for all of you that don't understand the way, the, the prosecutor is the lawyer on the side of the law. The lawyer on the side of the police. The lawyer on the side of the motherfuckers that want to incriminate you for the criminal acts that you have already, you have already committed, by the way. Because the prosecutor was on holiday. That's the reason why they pushed his date back again. To keep fucking with this nigga's money. Again, I'm mad for him. But at the same time, I'm like, well, yeah, this is kind of what you deserve. And I'll explain in a minute. But let me finish. Let me finish reading. <clears throat> I've consistently been trying to use my career to show people where I'm from that there is another life for us. But that's where you are wrong. And that's where you go wrong. Because they don't want you to show people where you are that you, the people that, you, that that live in the place that you're from that there's a better life no they want them to carry on committing them cr those crimes everything in this country is a business every even the police force the nhs if there's no criminal you think they're going to be able to make money as the police force no they're not going to be able to so who are you now personally that's going to go oh, let me show my brothers that is a better way you think the police want you to do that in fact I am willing to bet that the same reason why they are pushing your date back is this exact same reason that you have just said right there in the letter. 
but let me finish reading because I don't even want to. I don't want to get ahead of myself. Ah, uh, yes, one one away from uh, life, or one one away from the roads. Okay, I don't know what roads is talking about, but okay. But what can you do if the police, the justice system, and the home office don't care about you and put everything possible in your way to stop trying to to stop you trying to get on with your life? Next week's performance should have been a celebra celebration. What is the real reason here? How can you fail a background check to perform at a closing ceremony? And what does that even mean? So there are a couple of ways that you can, you can fail a background, background check. The number one way is if you have a criminal record, which I'm guessing is why they have deemed that your background check has been a failure. So if you have a criminal record as pending, you can't you can't be anywhere near the queen. That's like the law of this land. You, you can't do anywhere that you can't do anything that the queen is you know, associated with. Which is very ironic because this queen herself has killed millions of people, but we're not going to get into that one. Stolen millions of of, of pounds, billions of pounds, in fact, from countries in Africa, but we are not going to get into that one. So this is the same system that you think is going to give you your papers and let you live freely and happily ever after. Pasal you. Please answer my question. See, as black people sometimes, I just, I, Uncle Kamal just be getting mad. Because I feel like sometimes, as black people, sometimes we don't have sense. We don't have sense. You think that they really want you to be successful. Because you are signed to one of their friends. See that friend of theirs has 20 more rappers that's coming after you. He doesn't care. He doesn't give a fuck. Because if he did give a fuck, guess what you what will happen to you? Your case would have been sorted right now. Sorted and dusted. But it is not. And that should tell you something. But instead, you young man, you, you not you not use your sense. Instead, cloud, 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 cloud. Fucking bad bitches, fucking bad bitches. This year, that's what you focus yourself on. Instead of you to focus yourself on something that's simple as 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 getting yourself out of the system. And if you think rap is going to save you, it's not because they still look at you the same way. They still look at you the same way. So don't sell yourself to them and then complain and on, on the second breath. Sorry, I cannot feel sorry for somebody who is making money off of. You know what? I'm not even going to get into that because it sounds like I'm hating. You know what? I am hating. I am hating. Uncle Kamal is hating. Yes, I am. Because the truth has to be spoken at some point, right? Ha! We already know these people are like this. So why are you complaining? The only thing you should be focused on right now is making sure that you make sure that your legal affairs are in order. Because, Pasalu, I'm going to give you one more year. One more year. I know you have the bangers inside of you. But is niggas going to... Because you, you, you're, you have, you're hot right now. Fish grease. I won't even lie to myself. You're hot fish grease. But if you can't grow your career, if they are putting obstacles in your way, you just have to stay strong. Releasing this message on social media is not going to do anything for you. It's just going to make the situation worse. So Uncle Gamo is giving you good advice right now. Stay strong, number one. And number two, don't count on them to do what is right. Instead, you make sure you stop doing what is wrong. Anyway, Sha, F off.